All right, well, we have been feeling the cold this week, so <laughs> it's a good time to learn a little more about the science behind the ice and cold and how ice freezes on the lakes. And to help us do that, kitchen pantry scientist Liz Heineke is here with us this morning. Hello. Thanks for joining us. I'm happy to be here and talk yes. about our lakes. You've probably heard a lot of stories about people falling through the ice this yes. year. Um, according to the DNR, like this we have like 10 to 12 fewer ice days now than we had 50 years ago. Oh. And it's because of the warming climate. Mm -hmm. And also this was like the warmest December in the last uh -huh. 150 years. Yeah. So we're gonna, but now we're gonna get these cold snaps. So the mm -hmm. ice should get nice and thick for people to do their winter sports. Right. Mm. So ice is interesting on lakes. It freezes basically from the top down, freshwater ice. So I kind of demonstrated this. Kids can do okay. this at home. I just put some like peat moss. You could use dirt or anything. Yeah. In a Tupperware. And in here, I just put some water and blue food coloring. Set it out on my porch. It's going to be mm -hmm. really cold again next week. You yep. can do all these projects. But can you see how it's liquid at the bottom? I let it sit out overnight and it's yeah. ice. See the layer of ice on uh -huh. top? What happens, and this huh. is the same thing that happens if you freeze water in a balloon, mm -hmm. is that all the water has to get to 32 degrees, right? Freezing mm -hmm. temperature. And then the water that's closest to the surface, closest to the cold air, will start to freeze first and it freezes down. Mm. So you can do this. Oh. You can also, this is super fun for kids, just fill balloons up with water. You yeah. can add a little food coloring if you don't mind getting messy. Oh. Put them out on the porch or out in your backyard, I do it on a cookie sheet usually, they okay. will freeze from the outside in. So if you oh, keep an eye ooh. on them, you'll see that they, you get these hollow things. Oh, cool. You can actually take them out of the freezer, take the balloon off, dump the water out, and you can use these as like luminaries. You could put oh, glow right. sticks I've in them or candles. Glow sticks or candles in there. Yes. Yeah, that in is my cool. book, uh, Sheet Pan Science, uh -huh. I also came up with a project. Now everything's melting. I don't know how well it will work. <laughs> but if you put a little baking soda and okay. water and food coloring inside of these ice globes, some of these have holes in the side. They've, like I said, they're melting. And then dump vinegar in them. The vinegar and baking soda react. You make carbon oh, dioxide gas. Let's Should go ahead and start. Let's see if we can get some of these. The Whichever green. one you want. Okay. Let's that one see. has a hole in the side. So. Okay. Okay. All oh, oh, they all have holes in the side. Let's I mean, see. It's, it's not freezing here in the studio. I know. Which thankfully. we're thankful for. Okay. Yeah. If you let's do see. this, if you do this, this right one looks good. Let me see if I can get this one going. And they don't have holes in them. They will actually. There. There's there one we that's go. working. Oh, over the top. <laughs> one, of, one of eight works, so that's there we cool. go. Oh, that's amazing. It's a great way kids can do cool. the volcano reaction. You can also see how some of this ah, ice is clear and uh -huh. some of it's, that's called white ice. This happens on the lakes too. So mm -hmm. if you get a lot of freezing and like thawing and refreezing, mm -hmm. you get a lot of air trapped in the ice mm. and you get this white ice and that's like weaker than, than oh, clear is. ice, like than this clear ice. Yeah, so that's when cars are falling through the ice, it's often because you have this weak white ice oh. instead of like clear or blue ice. Yes, crystal sense. hard ice. Yes, oh, like okay. you see people huh. ice skating on. Yes, and, yes. Um, but yeah, these are all, and it's fun to just also like, kids can put food coloring in, uh -huh. they could like stick, you know, confetti or like plastic animals yeah. in a balloon oh, and then freeze different things in ice. You can put flowers in there. Oh, oh and just kind of decorate your yard with color amidst all yeah. the white. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's going to be that. really cold, but it's it's fun to have something kids can do outside. Mm -hmm. and yeah. Something you can't do all year long, right? Oh, yeah. When you're staying inside because it's too cold. When you're staying inside. You can yeah. play around with the ice. Play with very the ice. Cool. Well, thank you so much, Liz. This is very fun. We're excited to show the nieces and nephews. You can see mm -hmm. more of Liz's experiments at kitchenpantryscientist.com.